Hello everybody, it is Taylor here, and today this video is going to be about how to, like, it, it's things that, um, girls, you know, want but never ask for. Yeah, and, uh, there is one thing that I want to do, and first off, I know my camera sucks, so the, the, the shots might not be cool enough and it'll probably shake a little bit. <laughs> But, um, I never gave you guys an actual, actual, like, full tour of the house and the outside. So, <coughs> without further ado, let's just get this started. That's the tour of the house. Um, I was actually planning on doing that when the house was actually clean, because it actually looks really nice when it's clean, but, like, lately we've been slacking. Badly. But here's the main reason, and men, I know, at the title of this video, I think I still have it? I hope so. Um, actually, there's a story that I want to say. And probably my friend's going to fucking, um, watch this. So, anyway, I was in, during PE class, one of my friends, uh, <clears throat> you know what, fine, I'm actually gonna say his name because apparently he doesn't care. <sighs> Trent Hall, one of my friends, yep. So, as you all know, the first time, or the first, you know, situation I had... <laughs> Uh, he pissed at my sock. And now, you know what he does? You know what, you, you know what he does? Hmm. I'll tell you what he does. He squirts water all over me. And it, it, it wasn't just water, you know. It, it was water. But here's the lesson. For some people, they don't like being squirted on. Now, my lesson is... Ah, shit! My lesson to you guys is, don't squirt on each other, because guess what? Your other friend might be gay, and he might go... And he might, he, he just might. He might, he, he'll, he'll explode on you. My lesson is, don't fucking piss on other people's socks. And don't, don't squirt anything on people. Just be normal. And, and yes, that, that is the story. Alright, anyway... Okay, the main thing about this is, um, the main, th the main reason why I made this video is because I hope I still have it, um, but, uh, oh, right here. <sighs> 15 things a girl wants for her guy but won't ask for. Good morning, good night texts. Yeah, well, I mean, yeah, okay, there, there's no problem here, never mind, I'm, I'm a fucking idiot, just, just don't, yeah, just fuck me. Okay, the second thing is, pictures taken together. Now, okay, I'd say, I'm not really a picture person, but, um, yeah, I'll take pictures with her. It's just, hey, if, if you don't like getting pictures taken, why the fuck would you have that girlfriend? She's just tormenting you. And just saying, TAKE THE GODDAMN PICTURE! I mean, that's what my mom does, you know. She'd be like, hey, can I get this picture? I mean, we got videos, <laughs> you know. Vlog life, you know, we have that now. I, I, why, why do we need pictures? All you have to do is 
make a video, upload it, and it's there forever. Unless YouTube, you know, goes down and there's no more content. No more content? Oh, that gives me a boner. Anyway, uh, all right, next one. Uh, ne no, no, fuck, next, next one. Uh, surprises, especially little ones. Okay, you know, I, I do, I would do surprises, but like, yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Okay, next one. Visiting and bringing her favorite food. Yeah, I would do that, but like, you know, yeah, I, I have no problem with that. Okay, next one. Oh, a hoodie with his scent all over it. Okay. I mean, it's okay with me, but like, it's kind of, you know, for a man. I don't know. I mean, sure. But like, I just hope I don't have that girlfriend where she has to smell everything. Because that'd be weird. I mean, like, you, you, you'd go up to your house and she'd be sniffing your underwear. That guy's probably splooged all over him. And second, probably shit himself in it. And third, I honestly don't know what to say because men are weird. Okay, next one. <sighs> really long hugs. Now, for me, since I'm a, you know, for... I'm, like, a, a big heart person. Like, I have a big heart, so, like, yeah, I, I love hugs from girls, not men. I don't slap each other's, no. No. Well, hugs from girls. No, no, no dap dick slaps from, from, uh, from men. Anyway, but moving on. Slow dances. Now, okay, I'd be okay with that, but, like, yeah, I, I really don't have anything to say to them. That'd be fine with me. Okay, next one. Compliments. Okay, cool. Next one. Sing their favorite songs, even if it... The fuck? Oh, singing her favorite songs, even if it's out of tune. Now, honestly, pfft, fine by me. Okay, next one. A cute stuffed toy to hug when he's not around. Now, first off, I ain't gonna have no fucking teddy bear. Keep my girlfriend from, you know, um... He's thinking about sex, he's thinking about sex, he's thinking about sex. I know he is, I know he is, he's gonna say it, he's gonna say it, he's gonna say it. Like, when I'm gone. I'm never leaving. Uh, I, why would I leave? If I had a girlfriend and I'm not around, oh, that's just fucking messed up. Now, like, yeah, it, it's messed up. It's just buy her a goddamn teddy bear just for fun. Just don't keep it because you're going to be gone. I mean, what kind of a dick boyfriend would that be? Oh, I'm, I'm going to be gone. Here, Here's this teddy bear. You can, you can have sex with it, not me. Bullseye! I knew it! Everyone likes sex. Bitch! I don't want to have a teddy bear, bitch. I don't want to have a teddy bear having sex with my girlfriend. That technically be cheating, even though it's not a real organism. So, um, honestly, it, I'll just jab the fuck out of it, you know. I'm not a lunatic. It's just, it's not real. Okay, moving on. Real deep conversations. Now, I'm a guy. I am a guy, like, straight on that loves having deep conversations. Like, I don't think... I am a guy that ha ever has a chance, like, straight on, like, I even try to start deep conversations all the time. Like, I'm never, yeah, like, all the time. Okay, next question. Nonsense, but funny conversations, too. I am not a guy that can be funny. I'd probably be the guy that people would be laughing at, not laughing with me. So I'm not good there. I'm, I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna go with there. Okay, next one. His gentlemanliness. Okay, yeah, I mean, I'm pre I'm, a, I'm a gentleman. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, next one. Comfort her when she has tears. I don't know why I couldn't read that. Yeah, I'd definitely do that. I mean, another hug. Free hug, you know. Telling her how, how much you love her. Now, here's the thing about girls. 
Now, I've been having, like, a lot of girls, like, girls always post, I always wish that I had a guy that would actually tell me how, you know, they feel about me, but, like, here's the thing, I'm in a situation right now, which I haven't really been talking to her lately, and there's a situation, and she's dating this guy, a different guy, and I feel like this guy doesn't actually like her as much as I do. So I'm always sitting here, and I'm like, bitch. Now, I'm not really saying bitch, like, like I'm really going to call her that. Now, I still like this girl, and I'm not mad at her. It's just people make decisions, but it's like, I'm sitting here, and I'm like, I was ready. Like, I was ready to date this girl. I, I liked her when she had... The last boyfriend, and then she broke up with him, so I asked her out because I, was, I, was, I wasn't being cautious. I just went for it. I shouldn't have because it was like three days after. And I come in and I say, okay, can, can, can I go? Can I asked her out, and she's like, she's like, what? And I feel like she was making all these excuses up to not hurt my feelings. Honestly, if she told me the truth, I'd be fine. It's just that when she was lying... And my friend got into it, and then we got in an argument. We're not, we're not really good friends anymore. And I'm actually, I, honestly, I don't care, because he was kind of a dick friend anyway. So I'm honestly, I'm not trying to be a dick, but he, he was a dick. But anyway, it, it's like you're in the situation, and you think you know that you're better than that other person. And you know that you're actually going to, like, comfort her and, and do all these things. But it's like, she never, I don't, I don't know, it sucks because she doesn't, you always, you're, you're, you're laying down in bed, even though she's dating someone, you, some people, like me, they always sit down and they think, and they're like, you wake up in the morning, and the way you think about her, you think, you, you think that she's thinking the same way about you, but she really isn't, and, uh, it's, it's, it's hurtful because not only that, I was really heartbroken. That, that's probably the, that was the first time I've actually ever really cared about someone and tried to help and I actually wanted to love her and stuff, but, oh, it, I always thought it was going to happen, but it, honestly, I had my hopes up too much and it, it just, that's the thing. It, I mean, I know a lot of you've gone through this, but it's like, some people, in their perspective, they look at it a different way. And I did, and it's so crazy how you can get yourself worked up over one girl out of, like, so many girls out there. It's it's so weird to me. It is. It really is. It messes with your head. Like, it screws with you, and it, stay, and it, it stayed in me for a long time. I started failing my grades because of it. Luckily, I... Pulling my head out of my ass. <laughs> it's like what my dad says. But yeah, um, that is actually all for this video. Very not. This is not much. But uh, if you guys enjoyed this video, push the like button. I'll see you guys later. Black Earth. <laughs> Taylor out. Bye bye. <laughs>